I want to jump back just for a minute to what you said about it's not a trauma race, because this is a good point to to put that point back into evidence, uh, because it's not a trauma race. That is absolutely true. It's also not impossible or you don't have to have the kind of trauma that you experience, right, in order to come back from it. I want listeners who might be feeling like, okay, the host of the show lost $2.25 billion and the guest went through these just unspeakable things uh, from the time she was four until the time she was in her 20s. Um, I'm, that doesn't apply to me. It's not a trauma race. It's true. And it's not coming back from that, embracing the lessons there. What we say all the time, it didn't happen to me. It happened for me. That's what you did. That's what Warwick did. And that's what listeners and viewers can do as well, regardless of what their crucibles might be, right? Part of it not being a trauma race means you can bounce back from even what, quote unquote, lower level crucibles, right? It's the, the processes, how you move beyond your crucible um, have a lot of similarities, don't they? Oh, Gary, I'm so glad you brought that up because it's it's really true. I One of my dear friends who I met through my show um, was writing her book about addiction because she had food, alcohol, and drug addiction, and she had made her way through it. And she didn't realize for such a long time that she didn't have sexual abuse or physical abuse or any of this, but what she had was neglect by mm. parents who, um, for whatever reasons, just didn't give her the attention, the love, whatever it is, the guidance that she needed. And so for her, like she, she always felt like, well, I didn't have trauma. So I, I, I can't be on this like same journey of healing. Oh, well, neglect is, is a big part of it. Like if you didn't have that. So there's so many things and, you know, they'll label it big T and little T like little traumas. And I say it all the time. Trauma is trauma. Pain is pain. Heartache is heartache.